This is Jeff from Airstream Nerds. I came out to my camper to do a little maintenance and I noticed my emergency exit window, the screen spline had come undone. Now, I can't easily access the spline to wind it back in, so I'm gonna have to take these off. When I get back, we're gonna figure this out. It's been so So the first thing you need to do is get a pick or something like that and pull the little plastic insert out that they have covering up the screw head. So do that on both sides. On this particular blind, they only put bottom screws in because they couldn't access the top because of the cabinet. So take out the two screws and we'll pull the blinds down. I've pulled the spline out to the bottom. They put a little loop here for uh, safety so you can yank this out and push a screen out and climb out this window. Um, but in order to make a nice connection up here, a nice nice uh, seam without wrinkling up the, the screen, I've pulled it out to give myself a little bit to play with. Now, you're gonna wanna get a screen tool. Um, that is the best thing to use. Or you could get away with a screwdriver, although you have to be careful because um, you can gouge this and make it look pretty bad. Um, so I'm going to use a screwdriver just to tuck the corner in to get me started. And then I'm going to use, a, use the roller to roll it back around to the end here and get it all back in place. Like they have here, I just left a little piece stuck out. Um, once I wound it all in and I pushed... And, and I pushed it down. I went all the way back around. You have to be real careful when you're doing this that you don't push it up against the screen side because these things, especially the metal ones, tend to um, cut the screen. So you want to make sure when you're doing this that you're angled you know, down to the bottom of the spine. It doesn't take a lot of, a lot of pushing. Just roll it around the screen slowly. Do the corners. Make sure you make sure you're pushing down and make sure you just get the spline all the way deep in the crevice there. When you're all done, the, I'm not super concerned about this being a, a nice taut screen like, like the rest of them because this is an emergency screen. Um, uh, if something happens and we're back here, yank this out, push the window open and, and crawl out. So I'm going to go ahead and put the blinds back in with the two screws and the little plastic co screw covers. And we're going to wrap this up. That's how you fix a screen in our Airstream. This is Jeff from Airstream Nerds. Please comment below, hit the like button, and I'll see you on the next trip.